Keep praying until it happens. It's often said that prayer changes things. We're encouraged to pray without ceasing, to make prayer a daily habit. But today, I want to challenge you to take it a step further. Pray until something happens. That's what it means to push in prayer. When you feel like you've hit rock bottom, when your problems seem insurmountable, that's when you need to push in prayer. When trials come and setbacks frustrate you, get on your knees and start pushing. Pray until. Don't just pray and move on. Don't pray and start worrying. In the book of Daniel chapter 10, we see Daniel praying and persevering until he received his answer. He understood the power of persistent prayer, of praying until something happens. And that's the attitude we need to adopt in our own prayer lives. Whether it's for healing, for victory, for breakthroughs, we need to be relentless in our prayers. Be intentional, be prayerful, and above all, be persistent. Some days you might feel like giving up. Some days you might feel like your prayers are falling on deaf ears. But remember, God hears every prayer, and He is faithful to answer in His perfect timing. Keep pushing in prayer, keep believing, and keep trusting that God is working behind the scenes. And when doubts creep in, when the enemy tries to discourage you, remember who you are in Christ. You are not defined by your mistakes or your failures. You are a child of God, redeemed and loved by Him. Refuse to be labeled by the enemy. Stand firm in your identity as a child of God and keep pushing in prayer until you see God's promises fulfilled in your life.